Well, howdy, folks. Thought I'd come on here and post a video about <laughs> my DVD collection and Blu-ray collection. Uh, I notice I haven't done this in quite some time. I haven't posted anything regarding collections or anything like that. I haven't even posted updates or anything like that because, you know, that was just getting too crazy and because you never knew when I never knew when I was going to go out and buy something and or have the time to actually do a video but but instead I'm going to pan around the room pan around the shelf uh, you may know I tend to want to keep things in alphabetical order but uh, some things just because of the size of the box or the case or whatever you're you may find it a little out of order but uh, who cares? But uh, so I'm just going to take a look around the, the DVD shelves and kind of pan around and see how how well this goes. Here's just kind of a look around the room. This is what I call my movie room. And uh, see here we got posters of Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Chronicles of Narnia, Prince Caspian. Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith. We got Super 8 right there. And we got an E.T. poster. That is actually from the UK. Uh, that is why it doesn't really exactly fit in the... Uh, in the in the frame because the UK goes by completely different uh, ratios in terms of printing posters uh, and then we got uh, the Ten Commandments from 1989 the movie was originally released in 1956 so don't uh, confuse yourself but that is from the 1989 release and there we got uh, Captain America Civil War right there and we got a E.T. poster from 1988 when uh, E.T. was premiering on home video for the first time. Now check this out. I'm going to come a little bit closer. Uh, this is a, first of all, it's a 3D poster, so actually uh, E.T. does kind of stick out a little bit there. But also, check out the price tag on a good old VHS from 1988. $24.95. And it's $19.95 with a rebate from Pepsi. So yeah, you want to complain about high definition being uh, expensive. VHS was no different. Matter of fact, VHS was much worse. Um, yeah. But anyway, let's take a look at the DVD and Blu-ray collection. As you can see, we got several shelves here. I will try to go as fast as I can. Uh, don't worry about those. Those are all video games, so we probably won't be even looking at those. Okay, first up here, we have the complete James Bond collection. It goes from Dr. No all the way to Spectre, which was the last one they made. And then we come here, we got uh, 12 Angry Men starring Henry Fonda, also the Criterion version of that. Uh, 12 Monkeys, 13 Hours, 101 Dalmatians, 1776, 2001 on uh, DVD and Blu-ray. Some movies I do double dip on, so you're going to see that as well. The sequel, 2010, The Year We Make Contact, 21, 300, 300 Rise of an Empire, 300 Spartans, which was the movie that inspired 300, 310 to Yuma, the remake, and 310 to Yuma, the original from, when was it, 1957 on Criterion. Come down here, we got the 400 Blows, which is a Francois Truffaut film. Uh, try to get back in the shelf. Oh, I can get in there. And we got 48 hours. Another 48 hours. AD, the Bible continues. 
uh, AI artificial intelligence, the A team, the Abyss, Ace in the Hole, Act of Valor, Adventures in Babysitting, Adventure Land, After Earth, Airplane, and Airplane 2, the sequel, uh, Airport, the complete uh, disaster collection. Um, yeah, there was a series of movies based on a film called Airport. Uh, Air Force One, Aladdin on DVD from 2004, and Aladdin on Blu-ray, um, which I believe was 2013. Uh, Alexander and the Terrible, what is it? Alexander and the Terrible, Horribly, No Good, Very Bad Day. The complete series of ALF. That was one of my favorite TV shows as a kid. Actually, it was my favorite TV show uh, for a long time as a kid. But uh, never got this. Never got to, how do I want to say it, collect it until now. Thanks to DVD. Uh, all that jazz on Criterion Blu-ray. All the President's Men digital digibook edition. Uh, Alien, Aliens, and Alien 3. And we got All Dogs Go to Heaven, Almost Famous, uh, all of the Alvin and the Chipmunk movies, uh, Altered States, Amadeus, Always, Amazing Grace, um, America Lost and Found, the BBS story, and it has several films in it. Uh, let's see what it has in here. It has Head, Easy Rider, five, five Easy Pieces, Drive He Said, A Safe Place, The Last Picture Show, and The King of Marvin Gardens, along with a book to uh, go along and tell what the whole story was, because that inspired the whole 70s cinema right there. Uh, then we got American Gangster. Let's see if I can't put that back in the shelf. American Graffiti, American History X. American Pop, American Psycho, The American President, American Sniper, Amistad, An American Tale, American Tale, Fievel Goes West, Anaconda, Anatomy of a Murder, Anchorman. Uh, this, of course, is the original DVD. Had, that's the only version that had the, the theatrical PG-13 cut. But then I also got the Blu-ray, which has the unrated cut. And there's only two scenes that made uh, Anchorman unrated in the original movie. Then there's the sequel, Anchorman 2, The Andromeda Strain. Get closer down here. Uh, Angels in the Outfield, Animal House, Annie, Annie Hall, Ant-Man, The Apartment, Apocalypse Now, and Apocalypse Now Redo, Apollo 13, Appaloosa, The Apostle, uh, Arachnophobia, Argo, Armageddon, The Arrival, or it's just Arrival, I'm sorry. There is another film out called The Arrival, but uh, this is a completely different film. The Artist, Arthur, Audrey Rose, August Rush, uh, all three of the Austin Powers movies all in one set. Um... The Avengers, The Avengers Age of Ultron, Avatar, uh, The Aviator, The Babe, Baby, Secret of the Lost Legend, uh, Baby's Day Out, Back to the Future, Backdraft, Bad News Bears, The Remake, The Original, The Bad News Bears, and the two sequels, Bad News Bears and Breaking Training, and The Bad News Bears Go to Japan. Badlands, Bambi, uh, the Band of Brothers miniseries, uh, A League of Their Own, and The Natural. That's over here because baseball. Uh, Batman, uh, Tim Burton's Batman on DVD, as well as all four of the uh, Tim Burton, uh, Joel Schumacher, Batman movies. Um, we have Batman Mask of the Phantasm. 
Batman Assault on, Assault on Arkham, Batman Bad Blood, Batman The Dark Knight Returns Deluxe Edition, because there was two, it was actually a two-part movie that they uh, just combined together, so I just got that version. Uh, Son of Batman, Batman vs. Robin, Batman The Killing Joke, Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice, Batteries Not Included on DVD and Blu-ray, Battle Royale, Battleship, uh, the complete series to Battlestar Galactica, as well as the theatrical pilot. Um, yeah. Yeah, that uh, actually played in movie theaters. Uh, Be Kind Rewind, Beaches, Disney's Beauty and the Beast. Now I'll come back to this in a second. And we got the live action remake right here of Beauty, Disney's Beauty and the Beast. Now this was a TV show back in the 80s and early 90s, also entitled Beauty and the Beast, starring Linda Hamilton and Ron Perlman. Uh, Beer for My Horses, uh, Ben-Hur the Original, Ben-Hur the Remake, Beowulf, Director's Cut, Bella, The Bench Warmers, Best Little Whorehouse in Texas, uh, Better Off Dead, Betsy's Wedding, Beverly Hills Cop, The Beverly Hillbillies Movie with Jim Varney and Cloris Leachman, uh, The BFG, The Bible, the miniseries, The Bible in the Beginning, uh, film epic directed by John Houston, Big, and I've got about five seasons of The Big Bang Theory. Now, I'm going to say this right now. It is difficult to complete a TV show uh, unless you stay on top of it. If you're coming in late in the game to collect a TV show, good luck to you. We got The Big Country, Big Daddy. Big Fish, Big Hero 6, The Big Lebowski, Big Jake, Big Trouble in Little China, Kurt Russell, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, and the sequel, Bill and Ted's Bogus, Bogus Journey, uh, Bill Cosby himself. Birdman, Black Beauty, The Black Cauldron, Black Dog, Black Hawk Down, The Black Hole, Black Sheep, and I got The Black Stallion on Criterion Blu-ray, and up here I have the original Blu-ray. To the Black Stallion released by MGM and the Black Stallion Returns, the sequel. I'll move over here. We got Blade Runner, the complete uh, the com five disc uh, complete collection, which has um, about four different cuts. Yeah, four different cuts of the movie Blade Runner. Yeah, it's and, of course, a DVD that has about a three-hour documentary about the making of the film. Blazing Saddles, Bridge of Spies, The Blind Side, Blowout, The Blues Brothers, The Blue Collar Comedy Tour, the movie. I never got the others. Uh, Bobby, Body of Lies, The Boondock Saints. The Boondock Saints, All Saints Day, Director's Cut. The Book of Eli, Born on the Fourth of July. Borat, Bowling for Columbine. The Boy with the Striped Pajamas. The Brave Little Toaster, Braveheart. The Bre or Breakfast at Tiffany's. And The Breakfast Club, uh, Bridge to Terabithia. A Bug's Life. Come down to the second part of this shelf. Bull Durham, Bullet to the Head, The Burbs, Bully. Get a little bit closer. Burn After Reading, 
Caddyshack, Cahill, Call Me Claus, Capitalism, A Love Story, uh, Captain America, all three of those movies, uh, The First Avenger, The Winter Soldier, and Civil War. And this is Captain EO. This is a bootleg version of the Michael Jackson uh, Disney World ride, so that's what that is. Um, Captain Phillips, Cars 1 and 2. I have yet to get Cars 3. Casablanca, the case for Christ, the case for Christ documentary film, and the case for Christ live action dramatization. Uh, I guess you want to say uh, the one that was released by Pure Flix Entertainment. Uh, the James Bond parody, Casino Royale, Casino in the '90s, uh, best of the decade slipcover. We got Casper. Castaway, Catch Me If You Can, Cellular, The Changeling, The Change Up, Chappie, Chariots of Fire, uh, Digibook, and Chariots of Fire on DVD um, because of the bonus features. Uh, there's a whole second disc to that DVD. Uh, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory on DVD and the Blu-ray. A uh, Charlie Brown Christmas, Christmas with the Chipmunks, The Chipmunk Adventure, Chisholm, A Christmas Carol, the original, uh, the remake with George C. Scott, and the Jim Carrey Christmas Carol. Uh, a Christmas Story on Blu-ray and DVD. Uh, keep that, ni that nice DVD set as well. Uh, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, The China Syndrome. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, Chronicle, and then we got the Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, Witch, and the Wardrobe on both DVD and Blu-ray, as well as Prince Caspian on DVD, and the Blu-ray is down here. Uh, the, and then we got the third one, The Voyage of the Dawn Treader on Blu-ray, and that was the nice big uh, Blu-ray set that came out, and it was like a $90 value when it came out, sold for like... 30 bucks. Uh, the original Walt Disney Cinderella, as well as the live action remake. Citizen Kane, Digibook, Click, Cliffhanger, the original Clash of the Titans, and the remake Clash of the Titans. And we got uh, a little bit of Kevin Smith here, Clerks 1 and Clerks 2. Clear and Present Danger. Close Encounters of the Third Kind, 10 Cloverfield Lane, and Cloverfield, because those do go together. You may find, it, like, some of these, they don't, they actually do go together, but I've, for some reason, I've mixed them in alphabetically. But, uh, Clue, the movie, Coach Carter, Coal Miner's Daughter, Cobra, Cocktail, Cocoon and the sequel, Cocoon the Return. Cold Mountain. Collateral. Collateral Damage. The Color Purple. And we got two, we actually got about three uh, DVD sets here of, uh, this one has The Freshman, Holy Moses, Vice Versa, and A Fine Mess. This one has Mickey and Maud, Hanky Panky, uh, There's a Girl in My Soup, and Modern Romance. And this one is an eight movie collection called Criminally Clueless. And it has the films Disorganized Crime, Another Stakeout, Fatherhood, Oscar, Big Trouble, the Crew, Mafia, and Taking Care of Business. I'll just set that aside. Uh, we got uh, the Indianapolis Colts, The Road to XL1, Super Bowl 41, and then we got uh, the complete history, history of the Indianapolis Colts. And also we've got 
another film series of uh, kids sports films. We got Little Big League, Little Giants, Surf Ninjas, and Hometown Legend. And we got Commando, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Con Air, Conan the Barbarian, and Conan the Destroyer, the sequel. Uh, get down here a little bit further so you can see these. Uh, Contagion, Courageous, The Cowboy Way, Cowboys and Aliens, Crank and Crank 2, Crash, and we have one, two, three, four, five seasons of Criminal Minds, because I, again, because of the boxes, I had to shift some things around. We got also, also Crazy Heart and Creed. Then we've got the Critters Anthology, uh, Crocodile Dundee, uh, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button, the original DVD, and the Criterion Blu-ray. Uh, the Cutting Edge, Daryl, Dad, Daddy Daycare, The Dark Crystal, The Dark Knight, or sorry, Batman Begins, the Dark Knight, The Dark Knight Rises, because this is Christopher Nolan's Dark Knight trilogy, instead of going with Batman. We got Dances with Wolves, the, which has the director's cut version. Das Boot, The Day After Tomorrow. Day for Night, The Day the Earth Stood Still on both DVD and Blu-ray. And they also it also has the original version in there as well. Days of Thunder, Dazed and Confused, Deadpool, Dead Poet Society, Death Becomes Her. Shout Factory is doing a release, has done a release of that. I might have to get that. Um, Deep Impact, Deep Water Horizon, The Deer Hunter, Deja Vu, Deliverance on Digibook, uh, The Delta Force, The Departed, Dennis the Menace, and that's, of course, the John Hughes movie, Dennis the Menace with Walter Matthau. Uh, Despicable Me, two and three. And then we got uh, Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Never finished that film series. Uh, Die Hard, Die Hard 2. Die Hard with a Vengeance. Live Free or Die Hard, A Good Day to Die Hard. And we got the Dirty Dancing Collection. Dirty Harry Collection, which has four... Of the Dirty Harry movies. There was more than four. Um, we got District 9. The uh, Divergent series. Divergent, Insurgent, and Allegiant. Uh, Django Unchained. Do You Believe? Doctor Strange. Doctor Zhivago. In this nice two-disc set. Uh, Dodgeball. Dog Day Afternoon. Donnie Brasco. Doubt. Dr. Strangelove in the Digibook, Dragonheart, and uh, the sequel, Dragonheart 2, uh, Drillbit Taylor, uh, the complete series of Duck Dynasty, and it's all over the place because uh, I didn't, I missed out on seasons one through three on Blu-ray, um, I need to fix that one, but... Just kind of switching things around here in just a second. Uh, but what I was going to say is that uh, seasons one through six were released on Blu-ray, but then A&E, uh, because of the controversy behind the show and uh, the show dropping in ratings a little bit, decided to quit making them on Blu-ray and just released them on DVD only. So I was still able to complete the series, but uh, it kind of ticked me off that I wasn't able to do it on Blu-ray. Because Blu-ray is a superior picture quality. Uh, moving on, we got DuckTales, the movie, The Treasure of the Lost Lamp. Now, this is the Disney exclusive version. This has now been available for a number of years in the store. So, um, for a while, it was just a Disney movie rewards only a DVD. And we got uh, Duel, 
Dumb and Dumber, the unrated version. Dune, Dunkirk, the 2002 version of E.T. on DVD, which also includes the 1982 cut, but uh, that's the only way that you'll find the 2002 digitally enhanced version. Uh, then we got uh, the uh, E.T. Blu-ray digibook released in 2012. Earth to Echo, Earthquake, East of Eden, some James Dean. That's also on a digibook. Uh, we got Edge of Darkness and The Edge of Tomorrow. Uh, they ended up changing the title of this movie. I don't know why. Uh, they call it Edge of Tomorrow in the theater, but then once it came out on Blu-ray, they put this Live, Die, Repeat in big, bold letters on the, on the slip cover. And then the, I don't know why they did that. And so they ended up just, it was confusing people. And so they just ended up changing the title. Live, Die, Repeat, Edge of Tomorrow. Uh, Edward Scissorhands, Eight Below, Electric Boogaloo, which is a documentary all about uh, Canon Films. Really interesting documentary. And quite entertaining documentary as well. Uh, the Elephant Man. Elf. Elysium in a Steelbook. Um, 2012 and uh, Godzilla. And the reason that's over here because of the director, Roland Emmerich. So... Uh, Empire of the Sun, End of the Spear, Enron, the smartest guys in the room, documentary all about Enron and the financial collapse, uh, The Equalizer, Aragon, and we got the Ernest movies, Ernest Goes to Camp on Blu-ray, then again on DVD with Ernest Scared Stupid and Ernest Goes to Jail. And uh, we also got Ernest Saves Christmas there. That's the only one that Disney has held on to. All the others they've leased out to Mill Creek Entertainment. Um, the Escape Plan, National Lampoon's European Vacation, Evan Almighty. Don't ask me why I don't have Bruce Almighty. <laughs> Everest, Every Which Way But Loose, and Every Which Any Which Way You Can, the sequel. Ex Machina. Uh, Exodus of Gods and Kings. Uh, this one is Expelled with uh, Ben Stein. Um, the Expendables 1 and 2. The Explorers. Extract. Extremely Loud and Incredibly Close. Facing the Giants. Fahrenheit 451. And Fahrenheit 911. And there's a Family Favorites collection here which has a whole bunch of movies. It's about, I think it's about 10 movies. And it's got uh, Cloak and Dagger, The Wizard, Cop and a Half, King Ralph, Matinee, Sergeant Bilko, Ghost Dad, Ed, A Simple Wish, and The Borrowers. And it's all these movies from Universal Pictures. Uh, they're kind of, which were kind of mediocre films. Uh, you know, there is a fan base, you know, for films like Matinee and The Wizard and, um, but yeah, but like Ghost Dad, which is really a terrible movie, uh, this little Family Guy DVD that FYE gave me, uh, it's basically the three episodes that, three episodes that have the fights with, uh, Peter and the giant chicken, and then we got the, the Family Guy Star Wars, uh, trilogy, Blue Harvest, and something, 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 Dark Side, and it's a trap. Uh, Igmar Bergman's uh, Fanny and Alexander on Criterion. Uh, the Fantastic Mr. Fox on uh, Criterion. Fantasia and Fantasia 2000. Fargo, Fast and the Furious Trilogy, and 4. Uh, Fast and Furious 4. Uh, Fast 5, Fast and Furious 6, Fast uh, Furious 7. And I have yet to get the new one. <laughs> uh, Fast Times at Ridgemont High. Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. The Bueller Bueller Edition. A Few Good Men. Fiddler on the Roof. Finding Nemo. 
a Field of Dreams, The Fifth Element, Fight Club, and uh, two commercials that uh, I ended up starring in. Uh, Fireproof, Flags of Our Fathers on both DVD and Blu-ray. Uh, Flash of Genius, Flash Dance, Flight, Flight of the Navigator, the uh, John Goodman, uh, Rick Moranis version of the Flintstones, The Fly, For Richer or Poorer, Forever Young, Forrest Gump on Blu-ray and DVD. I have, and this is one of those movies I just have to double dip on um, because of features wise. And there's, there's features on both that are not included on either one. And plus, it's just a great movie. I enjoyed Forrest Gump. Food Inc., the following, which is the first film by Christopher Nolan. Footloose, the original, and Footloose, the remake. The Founder, Fred Claus, Friday Night Lights, and The Express movies. Uh, Free Willy. Frequency, Frost Nixon. Disney's Frozen. The Fugitive. Full Metal Jacket. Fury. G.I. Jane. G.I. Joe. Rise of Cobra. And G.I. Joe Retaliation. Um, Galaxy Quest. And Game of Thrones seasons one, two, three, four, five, and six down here. I have yet to get season seven. Uh, the Garth Brooks The Entertainer DVD set, which includes several concerts. Uh, the Game Change, Gangs of New York, Gettysburg, Ghost, Ghostbusters 1 and 2, as well as the Digibook that came out that had both movies and the Ghostbusters reboot. Uh, the Girl with the Dragon Tattoo, Giant, The Giver, Gladiator. Again, I had to double dip on that. I like me some Gladiator. And we got Glory. And we'll come up here to the next shelf. We got Glory Road, God's Not Dead, God's Not Dead 2. Uh, the Godfather, Godzilla, the original. Uh, Godzilla, the 2014 edition uh gomora gone fishing gone girl gone in 60 seconds gone with the wind good morning vietnam good night and good luck the green horn the green hornet goodwill hunting the good and the bad and the ugly good fellas the goonies the gospel of john the gospel road with johnny cash uh gray sun plugged the graduate that's another one I need to get on Criterion. Uh, Gran Torino, Gravity, Grease, The Great Dictator, uh, The Great Escape, The Great Gatsby with uh, Leonardo DiCaprio, uh, The Great Mouse Detective, The Great Outdoors, The Greatest Story Ever Told, The Green Mile, The Green Zone, Gremlins, and Gremlins 2, The New Batch, and The Gray. Uh, the Grinch... This is another one they changed the title of it when it came out on video. And that is, they now call it Dr. Seuss's How the Grinch Stole Christmas. But what are they going to call the, the new one that's coming out with Benedict Cumberbatch? You know, <laughs> we got The Grindhouse, uh, Tarantino, Robert Rodriguez double feature. This is the one that has all the fake trailers and everything put into put back into it. Um well, if you bought the individual films, um, you know, you got uh, something extra. Uh, Grudge Match, Guardians of the Galaxy 1 and Volume 2. The Gunfight the OK Corral, Hacksaw Ridge, Half Baked, Hancock, Hang 'em High, Happy Feet, don't have the sequel, Happy Gilmore, A Hard Day's Night, and what's... We got uh, Harold and Kumar, along with Beer Fest. That's all three of the Harold and Kumar movies. Uh, Harold and Maud, Harry and the Hendersons, Hearts War, The Hateful Eight, Hatfields and McCoys miniseries, uh, Heaven is for Real, Heaven's Gate, Heartbreak Ridge, Heat, Hercules, Charlton Heston Presents the Bible, and we got uh, Ben-Hur and the Ten Commandments 
in a double feature Blu-ray set. Uh, Hidalgo, High Fidelity, High Plains Drifter, High, High School Musical 1, High School Musical 2, High School Musical 3, and we got all five seasons of Highway to Heaven, starring Michael Landon, and uh, Hillsong, what's the full title, Let Hope Arise, the movie, The History of the Eagles, uh, all about the band, the, he the Eagles, great documentary, uh, History of the World, Mel Brooks' History of the World, Part 1, uh, all three of the Hobbit movies in the theatrical editions, and all three of the Hobbit movies in the extended editions. And we got Holiday Inn, Hollow Man, Harvey, Spartacus, and Touch of Evil in a Hollywood Legends uh, set from Universal. We got uh, Home Alone and Home Alone 2, the complete series of Home Improvement. Uh, Homeward Bound and Homeward Bound 2. Honey, I Shrunk the Kids and Honey, I Blew Up the Kid. Uh, I didn't really care for the, th the, the third movie that came out in that series. Uh, Hook on DVD and Blu-ray. Hoop Dreams and Hoosiers. We got Hoot. Hope Floats. Hotel for Dogs. Hotel Rwanda. House. Now this is a this is a strange movie. Uh, it's a horror film that is Christian based, <laughs> and it's rated R too. So uh, the fiftieth anniversary edition of How the Grinch Stole Christmas, as well as the original Warner Brothers DVD. I'm gonna try to pull it out. Yeah, there you go. It was latched on to how the West was won. And this is a this is a neat Blu-ray to have as well. Uh, if you can find this version, get a hold of it. Um, it's a Digibook edition, and it has the original smile box aspect ratio in it. So, yeah, because that's the way it's, see Cinerama. That was a widescreen format from back in the 40s and 50s. And that's how the shape of the screen was. It was in a smile box. Uh, how to eat fried how to eat fried worms. You see, I like a lot of kids' movies. Howard the Duck, Huck Finn, and Tom and Sawyer in a two pack from Disney. Uh, Hugo, uh, the Ang Lee Hulk, which I don't hate as much as some people do, but. Yeah, it is what it is. The Hunchback of Notre Dame. All four movies of The Hunger Games. Uh, we got... I'll show you this in a moment. Uh, the uh, Hunger Games, the first one. Uh, Catching Fire, Mockingjay 1, and Mockingjay 2. The Hunt for Red October. I Am David. I Am Legend. I Am Number 4. I, Robot. I'll Be Home for Christmas, Tim Hawkins, I'm No Rock Star, I'm Not Ashamed, Imposter, The Impossible. Now, this movie has a young, what is it, the, the, the new Spider-Man, what's his, Tom Holland. This was one of his earlier movies, and he was kind of a young, really, really young kid in that movie. There we go. And then we got Immortals. Uh, in the Heat of the Night with uh, Sidney Poitier and Rod Steiger. In the Line of Fire, Inception, The Incredible Hulk, The Incredibles, Independence Day, The Indian in the Cupboard. I'll scoot back a little bit. On both DVD and Blu-ray, I probably intend to get rid of that DVD because everything is on there that's the same. The original Indiana Jones DVD. Uh, DVD box set and uh, Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull on DVD as well as the complete Blu-ray set. Um, and we got Inglorious Bastards, Inner Space, Inside Job, Inside Out, Insomnia, Interstellar, Into the Storm, Invaders from Mars, Invader, Invasion of the Body Snatchers, 
and a later remake, The Invasion. Uh, there's this documentary about uh, Industrial Light and Magic, was, which was really good, aired on, uh, I think it was Stars. Yeah, uh, then we got The Iron Giant. We got Iron Man, the Iron Man movies, one, two, and three, The Island. It's a mad, 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 mad world. It's a wonderful life on both DVD and Blu-ray. Jackie Brown, Jailhouse Rock, Jarhead, Jaws. It's the 40th anniversary edition. Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back, The Jerk, Jesus of Nazareth on DVD, and here's the Blu-ray version, which this is originally a TV miniseries. Uh, this version from Shout Factory uh, actually uh, maintained the miniseries like feel and has it in the four episodes or whatever. And um, while this DVD version is on two discs and they combined it all together as one movie. And it's, so it's like a total of six hours. And then we got Jesus Factor Fiction, which has this film has the popular film Jesus, um, which has been seen all over the world. Uh, Jetsons the movie, Jingle All the Way, Joe Dirt, Joe versus the Volcano, John Adams miniseries, John Wick and John Wick 2, Journey to the Center of the Earth, Joy, The Judge, Jumanji on DVD and Blu-ray, the original Disney's Jungle Book and the live-action remake. Uh, Jurassic Park 1, 2, and 3 on DVD and the Jurassic Park Trilogy Blu-ray set. Uh, Jurassic World, Justice League, the complete series of Justified. Uh, Karate Kid 1, 2, and 3. I stopped after that because there, there are technically no other Karate Kid movies. I'm not even counting that freaking Jackie Chan, Jaden Smith piece of crap. Sorry, it is bad. Uh, kick ass, the kid, the kid stays in the picture, the kid with a bike, Kill Bill, volume one and two, Killer Clowns from Outer Space, King Kong, the original in Blu-ray Blu Digibook, and Peter Jackson's King Kong. Um, yeah, that also has the... Peter Jackson's extended edition, which I'm sorry, that movie did not need to be three hours anyway. That there, Why would you want to make it longer? Uh, the King and I, The King of Comedy, King of Kings, The King's Speech, Kingdom of Heaven, Kong, Skull Island, uh, Kramer vs. Kramer, Crawl, La La Land, Labyrinth, Lady and the Tramp, Larry the Cable Guy, Health Inspector, the Land Before Time, Last Action Hero, The Last Sin Eater, The Last Starfighter, Law Abiding Citizen, this nice two disc edition of Lawrence of Arabia, and the Blu ray version. Then we got Lawless, Left Behind, The Legend of Billie Jean, Legends of the Guardians, The Owls of Gahul, The Lego Movie, The Lego Batman Movie, uh, Lemony Snickets of an, a Series of Unfortunate Events with Jim Carrey. Les Miserables, all four of the Lethal Weapon movies. Let There Be Light. Let's Go to Prison. Letters from Iwo Jima. Letters to God. Life, Life Itself, all about Roger Ebert. Life of Pi, Lincoln. The Lion King 2003 DVD release. And the 2003. 12 for 2011 Blu-ray release. Uh, Lions for Lambs. The complete series of Little House on the Prairie, including this uh, little special DVD. Have your uh, Mary Ingalls Christmas. Uh, the Little Mermaid. The Little Rascals on DVD and The Little Rascals on Blu-ray. Uh, little Shop of Horrors. Logan's Run. The Lone Survivor. The Long Riders. The Longest Day, The Longest Yard, the original with Burt Reynolds. Uh, Look Who's Talking. Uh, Looney Tunes Spotlight Collection 1, 5, 6, and 7. 
uh, those are kind of tough to track down. Uh, Lord of the Flies, the original. Uh, the Lord of the Rings, the theatrical cut versions. And the Lord of the Rings extended edition box set. And the original 1970s Ralph Bakshi animated version of the Lord of the Rings. Uh, Love Story, Lucy, MASH, the original film. And the complete series of the TV show. Mac and Me, Machine Gun Preacher. Uh, the Mad Max Trilogy, which has uh, the original Mad Max, The Road Warrior, and Mad Max Beyond Thunderdome. Then we got Mad Max Fury Road. Uh, the, the original, The Magnificent Seven. And the remake, The Magnificent Seven, with Chris Pratt and... Uh, Denzel Washington. We got the Majestic, Major Pain, Make Way for Tomorrow, Mall Rats, Man on Fire, Man of Steel, uh, the original version of the Manchurian Candidate. And yes, these are, if you see a spine like this on my collection, it's, they are officially DVDs, but they are part of those movies you buy where they came out of a rental machine or something. And then we got the remake with Denzel Washington, Mars Attacks, Mary Poppins, The Martian, Martian Child, The Mask, The Mask of Zorro, Master and Commander, The Far Side of the World, uh, The Matrix Trilogy, uh, Maverick, Max, The Maze Runner, and Maze Runner, The Scorch Trials. Bullet and Papillon with uh, Steve McQueen. Meet the Parents, Memento, Men in Black, Men in Black 2, uh, Mercury Rising, Miami Vice, Mickey's Christmas Carol, Michael Clayton, Midnight Cowboy, Midway, Mighty Joe Young, A Million Ways to Die in the West, Minions, uh, Minority Report on DVD and Blu-ray, uh, Miracle, Miracle on 34th Street, the original, and the remake back in the 90s, uh, Miracles from Heaven, and we got Mission Impossible 1, Mission Impossible 2, Mission Impossible 3, Mission Impossible Ghost Protocol, and Mission Impossible Rogue Nation. Mission to Mars, Modern Times, Mom's Night Out, M Monster House, Monsters Incorporated, Monsters University, Monty Python and the Holy Grail, Moonstruck, uh, Morning Glory, uh, Movie 43, don't ask me why I have that, uh, Mr. Holland's Opus, Mr. Smith Goes to Washington, Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Mrs. Doubtfire, Mulan, and Mulan 2, uh, The Mummy Collection, which has The Mummy 1 and The Mummy Returns, and the Scorpion King. It was before the third Mummy movie came out, which I don't care to see. Uh, Munich, uh, The Muppets, Muppets Christmas Carol, The Muppet Movie, Muppet Treasure Island and The Great Muppet Caper, Muppets Take Manhattan, Trading Places and Coming to America in a two-pack, The Music Man, My Cousin Vinny, my Darling Clementine, My Girl, Mystic River, Nacho Libre, Napoleon Dynamite, uh, IMAX, nice, uh, IMAX NASCAR, Nashville, The Nativity Story, Network, Never Say Never Again, which is an which is a unofficial James Bond movie. That's why it sits over here. And we got uh, the first season of Newsroom. Never completed that show. Wish I had. The Never Ending Story. The Never Ending Story 2, the next chapter, or chapter, and of course the DVD that has both movies in a two-pack. Uh, Newsies, uh, Night at the Museum series, 1, 2, and 3. Night of the Hunter, uh, Night to Remember, Nightcrawler, 9 Months, 9 to 5, Nixon, No Country for Old Men, Noah, The Notebook, Now You See Me. The Nutty Professor, Oh Brother Where Art Thou, October Sky, Office Space, An Officer and a Gentleman, Old Yeller and the sequel Savage Sam together, 
uh, Oliver, Oliver and Company, The Omega Man, On the Waterfront, Once Upon a Time in America, and Once Upon a Time in the West, One Who Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, One Magic Christmas, One Night with the King, Open Range, uh, these uh, Christmas originals, which is like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, Santa Claus is Coming to Town, and Frosty the Snowman, uh, Over the Top, uh, Outfoxed, uh, The Outsiders, The Outlaw, Josie Wales, Digibook, um, The Pacific Miniseries, Pacific Rim, The Pacifier, The Passion of the Christ, Pale Rider, Paris, Texas, Passengers, Patch Adams, and What Dreams May Come, uh, Paths of Glory, Patriot Games, The Patriot, uh, Patton on Blu-ray and Patton on DVD. Now, this is the version that you want uh, if you're going to find this movie. Uh, do not buy the first edition of Patton on Blu-ray because it was a DNR mess. This one has actually been given a proper, I believe, a proper 4K transfer. So, yeah. Then we've got Paul. Uh, Paul Blart, Mall Cop, Pay It Forward, uh, Pearl Harbor, The Peanuts Movie, come back up here to the top, next shelf, we got Pee Wee's Big Adventure, The Perfect Storm, uh, The Complete Series to Person of Interest, Persecuted, Peter Pan, Nanny McPhee, and the live action version of Peter Pan, uh, Pete's Dragon, uh, the original and the remake. Uh, Phone Booth, The Pink Panther, Pinocchio, um, the uh, Platinum Edition DVD, and the Signature Series Blu-ray. Um, yeah, I really wanted to upgrade that. All of all four of the Pirates of the Caribbean. I haven't got five yet. Uh, Pitch Perfect and Pitch Perfect Two. Uh, Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. Pretty much all the Planet of the Apes movies. Um, yeah, we've got the, the Planet of the Apes 5 film collection. Tim Burton's Planet of the Apes, Rise of the Planet of the Apes, Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, and War for the Planet of the Apes. Then we got Platoon, Pocahontas, The Polar Express, Police Academy, The Poltergeist Films. I do not have the remake, thankfully. Um... Popeye with Robin Williams, uh, Porky's The Poseidon Adventure, the original, and the remake, which is just called Poseidon. Prancer, Predator, and Predator 2. The Prestige, Pretty in Pink. Prince of Egypt, The Princess Bride, The Pride of the Yankees. Prisoners, Prometheus, Project Almanac, Public Enemies, Pulp Fiction, Punch Drunk Love, Pure Country, The Purge, The Punisher, and we got, uh, I went, almost went down the shelf too far, uh, Race to Witch Mountain, Ragamuffin, Raging Bull, Rain Man, um, we got Rambo, First Blood Part 2, Rambo Plus, Rambo Part 3, and Rambo. Now, I do have First Blood, but it's in a Sylvester Stallone collection. You'll see that later on. Uh, Rango, Ratatouille, Ray, Real Steel, Rebel Without a Cause, Blu-ray, Red, Red 2, Red Dawn, the remake, Red, no, Red Dawn, the original, then Red Dawn, the remake, uh, an old John Wayne film called Red River, and we got Remember the Titans and the Rescuers. Get them to set on the shelf properly. Now, down to the bottom part. Uh, Reservoir Dogs, Return to Oz, The Revenant, Revenge of the Nerds, The Right Stuff, Rio Bravo on both DVD and Blu-ray, Riot and Cell Block 11, Risen, Risky Business, The River Wild, The Road, Roadhouse, The Robe on both DVD and Blu-ray, uh, Disney's Robin Hood, and uh, the original The Adventures of Robin Hood, with Errol Flynn. 
And we got uh, Mel Brooks's Robin Hood Men in Tights uh, and Robin Hood Prince of Thieves. And then we got Robinson Crusoe on Mars. Robocop, the original, The Rocketeer, The Rock, all the Rocky movies, uh, including this documentary, The Rocky Story, and of course, all of them on Blu ray there. Yes, I double dipped. I have Rocky 3 and 4. No, it's uh, 4 and 5, I'm sorry, on Blu ray. I double dipped. Um, the Rocky Horror Picture Show, Roger and Me, uh, Roller Boogie, The Row, or The Rose, I'm sorry, The Rose, uh, Rudy, The Running Man, Safe House, Safe Haven, Same Kind of Different Me, or Different as Me, sorry, uh, The Sandlot, San Andreas, all the Santa Claus movies. Uh, Saturday Night Fever, Saving Mr. Banks, Saving Private Ryan on both DVD and Blu-ray with the DVD being this nice big box set. Uh, Say Anything, Scarba, uh, Scarface, I don't know if I'm thinking Starbucks, but <laughs> Scarface and uh, Steelbook, uh, we got Schindler's List, Scanners, uh, School of Rock, Scooby-Doo, uh, Scott Pilgrim vs. the World, Scrooge, Scrooged with uh, Bill Murray, um, Searching for Bobby Fisher, Secondhand Lions, The Secret of Nim, Selma, Seven, Seven Samurai, The Shack, Jack Ryan, Shadow Recruit, Shadow Recruit uh, The Shallows, Shawshank Redemption. Sherlock Holmes and Sherlock Holmes, A Game of Shadows, The Shootist, Shock Treatment, and I got a couple of my church DVDs in there as well. Um, we got uh, Short Circuit 1 on Blu-ray, Short Circuit 2, uh, Shorts, All the Shreks, 1, 2, 3, and 4, Shutter Island, Sicko, Sideways, Signs, The Silence of the Lambs, Silver Linings Playbook, Simon Birch, uh, Sister Act 1 and 2 in a 2-pack, 16 Candles, The Sixth Sense, Sky Captain in the World of Tomorrow, Sling Blade, Slum Dog Millionaire, Small Soldiers, Smokey and the Bandit, The Pursuit Pack, uh, Snake Eyes, Snakes on a Plane, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, The Social Network, Solaris, Something Wicked This Way Comes, Son of God, Son of Rambo, Sons of Katie Elder, Sons of Liberty, Soul Surfer, The Sound of Music in the 50th Anniversary Edition, and the 40th Anniversary Edition Blu-ray. Uh, or, I'm sorry, 40th Edition DVD. <laughs> uh, Soylent Green, Spaceballs, Space Cowboys, Space Jam, Species 1 and 2. I've stopped after that. <laughs> Uh, Speed, uh, the the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man trilogy, uh, the Amazing Spider-Man one and two, and then we got Spider-Man Homecoming, uh, Spider-Wick Chronicles, Spies Like Us, SpongeBob SquarePants movie, um, Sponge Out of Water, uh, Stagecoach, Rambo First Blood, Copland, and Lock Up all in a three pack. Uh, Stand By Me, Star Trek, the motion picture, the director's cut, uh, the Star Trek motion picture on Blu-ray in the theatrical cut, and we got pretty much all the Star Trek movies, <laughs> yeah, we got two, three, four, five, six, and then Generations, First Contact, Insurrection, Nemesis, and then there's this uh, Captain's Summit DVD, or Blu-ray, I'm sorry. The cases sometimes throw me off. Um, we got Abrams Trek uh, of, that's why I call Abrams Trek and then Star Trek Into Darkness and Star Trek Beyond, which was not directed by J.J. Abrams. Uh, and we got all the Star Wars trilogy, all the Star Wars saga here on both DVD and Blu-ray. Um, and of course this has the prequels 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, and 6 are the versions that have both the Lucasified versions and the 
uh, the original versions. And this bonus material disc, um, which has making of documentaries, several making of documentaries. And the original Blu-ray box sets, uh, which only contain the Lucasified versions, unfortunately. Come on, Disney, you now own 20th Century Fox and Lucasfilm. Get on the ball and get the original versions released. And then we got uh, Star, Tre Star Wars, The Force Awakens, Star Wars, The Last Jedi, and then Rogue One. The See, here's how this one's going to set up. Is I'm going to put the canon movies like together, but I'm going to put the non-canon off to the side. And we got uh, Starman, Straw Dogs, Step Brothers, The Stepford Wives. Uh, this Oliver Stone collection, which has Natural Born Killers, Any Given Sunday, and JFK. Storks, The Straight Story, Strange Brew, Streetcar Named Desire, Digibook, Sucker Punch, Sully, Super 8 in the original Blu-ray, and Super 8, the Iron Pack version, which I just thought was neat to have. Uh, then we got uh, the Colts. This probably should be with the Indianapolis Colts, but I just call it Super Bowl 41 champions, the Indianapolis Colts DVD, Super Size Me, Super Troopers, Superman the Movie, which has the extended cut, and uh, Superman the Original Theatrical Cut, uh, Superman 2, the Theatrical Cut on DVD, and then this Superman Anthology, which has a grief. It has pretty much all of the Christopher Reeve uh, Superman movies and Superman Returns as well as uh, Superman 2 the Richard Donner cut uh, and Superman Returns on DVD uh, surrogates sweet smell of success Disney's uh, Swiss Family Robinson taken taken two taken three talk radio the taking of Pelham 123 the original Talladega Nights, Tarzan, Taxi Driver, uh, this Richard Burton and yeah, Richard Burton and Elizabeth Taylor collection, which has Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf, the VIPs, the Sandpiper, and the Comedians. And we got Ted. Don't have Ted too. Let me see if I can squeeze this back in. There we go. The original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles collection. And we got the Michael Bay produced Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and the sequel. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows. And we got the Ten Commandments original DVD. Uh, the Terminator. Terminator 2 Judgment Day Extreme DVD Edition and the Skynet Blu-ray Edition, which I know has a terrible transfer, as well as that Predator set. And then T3 Rise of the Machines on DVD and Blu-ray. Terminator Salvation, which, which is the theatrical cut. And I, uh, somewhere around here, I think... Yeah, it, al it also has the R-rated cut in there as well. So, uh, I think it does. Huh, I haven't put this one in in a while. But, uh, actually, I think this is just the theatrical cut, but oh well. Then we got Terminator Genesis. And then uh, There Will Be Blood on DVD, which is this the slim thing and we got there will be blood on blu-ray they live Thelma and Louise thief thin red line 13 days Michael Jackson's this is it the thing and the thing prequel this is spinal tap this is the end Thor actually all three of the Thor movies three three amigos the three musketeers THX 1138, uh, Timeline, The Tin Drum, The Adventures of Tin Tin, 
Titanic, the original from 1953, and James Cameron's Titanic on Blu-ray. Uh, to Kill a Mockingbird on Blu-ray and the Legacy Series DVD set, which is a nice DVD set to have. Um, to Save a Life, Tombstone, Tomorrowland, Top Gun, Tora Tora Tora, Tommy Boy, Tootsie, Total Recall, Towering Inferno, The Town, The Toy, Toy Story, uh, all three of those, Traffic, The Train Robbers, Training Day, uh, all the Transformers movies on both DVD and Blu-ray, uh, this Transformers uh, Beginnings that came with the original Transformers DVD at Walmart, the original Transformers the movie, from 1985, Treasure of the Sierra Madre, Tremors, Tron on DVD and Tron on Blu-ray, Tron Legacy, Tropic Thunder, Troy, True Grit the original, True Grit the remake, True Lies, The Truman Show, The Twilight Zone, the movie, Twister, Two Lane Blacktop, UHF, Unaccompanied Minors, Unbreakable DVD and the Blu-ray, Unbroken, Uncle Buck, uh, Unforgiven, Digibook, uh, Untouchables, Up, Cheech and Chong, Up in Smoke. Let me get down. There's, there's Up in Smoke. Urban Cowboy, The Usual Suspect, National Lampoon's Vacation, Valkyrie, Videodrome, Village of the Damned, uh, the Visitation, Viva Las Vegas, W, Waiting for Superman, Waking Sleeping Beauty, Walmart, The High Cost of a Low Price, Walk the Line, Walking Across Egypt, Wall Street, The Walk, Walking Tall, Wally, -E, Bridge on the River Kwai, and The Guns of Navarone in the Two Pack, uh, War Horse, War of the Worlds, War Room, War, Ra War Wagon, say that two times fast. Um, Warcraft, War Games, Warrior, The Warriors, Watcher in the Woods, The Watchman, the original theatrical cut, and The Watchman uh, Director's Cut. There's also another cut, uh, the ultimate cut, um, but uh, I think that was a little pricey at the time, and I think that's out of print. Uh, Watership Down, Wayne's World, The Cowboys, The Green Berets, and the Searchers all in one pack. So that's a John Wayne pack. Um, we Were Soldiers, Wedding Crashers, Weird Science, We're Back, A Dinosaur Story, We're the Millers, Where the Red Fern Grows, and a couple other films in there. Uh, West Side Story, West World, the original film, and West World Season 1, the TV show. Uh, probably be collecting that show starting up. Season two is about ready to air. So, uh, where the wild things are, when the game stands tall, White Christmas, White Fang, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, The Wild Bunch, Wild Hogs, Willow, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, Without a Paddle, Witness, The Wiz, The Wizard of Oz on both DVD and Blu-ray. Uh, one's a 75th anniversary edition. The other one's just the 70th anniversary edition. Uh, season one of WKRP in Cincinnati. Have yet to finish that TV series. Uh, the Wolf of Wall Street, Wreck-It Ralph, The Wrestler, World War Z, Wonder Woman. And I need to finish The Wonder Years. I've only got four seasons. I need to pick up the last two seasons of that. Which I think is only on the internet, uh, according to Amazon. Uh, Woodlawn, Woodstock, Wyatt Earp, X-Men 1.5, X2, X, uh, X-Men The Last Stand, X-Men First Class, X-Men Days of Future Past, X-Men Apocalypse, X-Men Origins, Wolverine, The Wolverine, and Logan. Yes, because that is part of that whole thing. Um, Triple X State of the Union. It's the only Triple X movie I've, I've got. It's the one with Ice Cube. It's not that great of a movie, but oh well. Yes Man, Sanjuro, and Yojimbo. Um, Young Frankenstein, Young Guns, Young Guns 2, The Young Messiah, Young Sherlock Holmes, Yours, Mind, and Ours, 
Zathora Zodiac, the theatrical cut on DVD, and uh, Zodiac, the Blu-ray um, director's cut. Yeah, and then remember what I was talking about the Hunger Games being in that one thing? Well, here's the box set that it came in. And it's just this nice box set with uh, with a nice paperweight inside, along with the digital copy code, which has already been redeemed. So, you, and plus, I didn't even get to show it to you. We got a couple more things here uh, I want to show. Um, I've got uh, Stranger Things season one. This is the Target exclusive. I hope they put the other two, I hope they put out season two on uh, DVD and Blu-ray because I really got into the show. It was really good. Now, over here in this corner, I didn't show these. Um, they, they've been doing these uh, animated, DC animated movies, but also they've been putting out limited editions of these comic books, and it has the movie adaptation which they are supposedly based on so that they're adapting these comic books or graphic novels into the animated movies and then they're putting them out on dvd and blu-ray but uh, these have the nice blu-ray um versions in it so here's justice league volume one origin and the film is justice league war and then we got Batman Year One, the legendary uh, graphic novel by uh, Frank Miller. And it's got, um, what's the film? It's Batman Year One on uh, DVD and Blu-ray. And we got Batman Black and White. And the film is, is the film uh, Gotham Knight? Because the, the films don't always... Uh, have the same title as the comic book and we got uh, the death of superman and the film was called uh, superman uh, doomsday yeah so there you go that's everything i haven't even shown you my vhs's but those really aren't um worth showing um i just got a few of those and a lot of those i've kind of recorded stuff on uh, however there is one more thing the ten commandments box set yeah as you can see i double dip like crazy on the ten commandments et and several other films um but yeah i know it's about the length of a movie that's going around but uh I'll put in the put a caption about how many titles there are and how many discs. Um, yeah, it's I got a lot of stuff, but that's nothing compared to what some other people have. They have about twice as much as what I have. So from me to you, see you later.